this is Alex. I'm the new teen librarian here at the Churchland Branch of the Portsmouth Public Library. And uh, I got some new books that I'm excited to share with you and just want to let you know that we're open and uh, you can come in and browse and we're excited to see you. So we hope you, you'll come in. But we got a ton of new titles. We got a whole new, new release gondola. Uh, the graphic novels are now out on the main floor. So it gave us a little bit of space to feature some books for y'all. So, uh, books I'm excited about. Number one, Jennifer Lynn Barnes, The Inheritance Games. This is a really fun book. Uh, it's about this um, girl, Avery Kylie Grams. Uh, she lives with her adopted sister, her stepsister. The relationship's not really explained. But anyway, they live in Connecticut. Uh, they're not exactly wealthy. Uh, her sister works as a waitress and she's just trying to finish high school when all of a sudden uh, it's informed that she has to go to Texas for a will reading and she finds out she's the inheritor of a $46.2 billion fortune uh, of the Hawthorne family in Texas. And the fun part is nobody knows why, including Avery, and the Hawthorne family kinda goes after her for it. Uh, there's four brothers she has to work with on this and uh, in the end they uh, each have their own personality and their own adventures and uh the tobias hawthorne the patriarch of the family who dies was really into puzzles there's a lot of different puzzles and quizzes to solve and it's it's really a fun exciting read and you'll probably want to do it now because the sequel comes out in the fall so that's one to check out the inheritance games by jennifer lynn barnes definitely worth checking out number second book i'm really excited about this is the debut novel debut novel by chloe gong um it's these violent delights this is a retelling of Romeo and Juliet set in 1920s Shanghai. Uh, if you don't know a lot about the history of China prior to about 1949, uh, it's really an exciting and amazing place. I studied uh, modern China in college and learned all about that change. And uh, I, I really think this is gonna be an exciting book full of gangsters and crime and, you know, rival families. Of course, Romeo and Juliet, if you know that story at all, if you don't, um, it's all right, watch the Boz Lerman film. You'll learn everything you need to know about that. <laughs> English teachers will tell you to read the book, but the movie, that movie's pretty good. It covers it all. Um, so anyway, These Violent Delights, highly recommended, really good book. Uh, also, if you're really into Marvel and uh, you're checking out that new Loki show on Disney+, Plus, um, I am, it's fantastic. Oh man, so much fun, time travel's always one of my favorite, favorite, things to uh, check out in science fiction but uh, we have Loki Where Mischief Lies by Mackenzie Lee um, this tells of young Loki before all the MCU and all of that um, really fascinating book you'll love the Avengers if you, if you like Loki this is the way to go if you're really into that series you know give it a little extra with with uh, this and his backstory um, it's approved by Marvel and Disney so it's canon good stuff all right uh, on the graphic novel front, I'm really excited about this one. Uh, this is the graphic novel version of Be More Chill by Ned Vizzini. Um, what it is, is basically, let me get in there, Jeremy. That's the name of the character, right? I had a complete brain for that. Jeremy is your pretty average high school dork. Uh, he doesn't fit in, he wants to be cool, he wants to be popular, so he's introduced to something called the squid. And the squid is something that gets implanted in himself and it makes him cool. It makes him in there. But of course, with all technology and something like this, it slightly goes wrong. Uh, but it's exciting. It's a great read. The original book is great too. Uh, and then also, uh, if you really get into it, there's a fantastic Broadway musical uh, based on this book. So uh, it's a fun story. Definitely check it out. And then lastly, we got a little bit of nonfiction for you. If you're into music, if you're into hip hop, like I am, you wouldn't think it like this, but uh, you know, been listening to it for a long time. This is Can't Stop Won't Step by Jeff Chang and Dave Davy D. Cook. Uh, this is a really great book. It's been around a while. This is the new young adult edition, uh, basically on the history of hip hop, uh, all the way from you know Sugar Hill Gang, Curtis Blow, Run DMC, all the way. I think it goes all the way up until today with trap music and Drake and and all that. But um, really recommend this one. Uh, if you like music history, if you want to know more about hip hop, this is a real solid book to go with. Um, we have more uh, music books about that out there, but this is a great place to start. Really good history, and 
and I, I think the Young Adult Edition will be fantastic for you. Of course, these are only just five of the new books we have. We're getting new books every week. We've been processing everything that we've gotten through the pandemic and getting it ready for you. Of course, if you have your library card and pin, you can reserve all of these on hold for you. You can come pick them up. You don't have to come all the way back into the teen room, but I'd love you to see the, the rearranged teen room and uh, yeah, find some of your favorites. Uh, we also do curbside pickup if you're afraid to come in. But until then, uh, I hope you come check out these books or something else and uh, find your passion. And uh, if you need any help, feel free to reach out to me. If you want to get in involved uh, with videos for the library, send me an email, grosbya at portsmouthva.gov. And uh, maybe we can get that set up, send me a book review, um, a vlog, something library related. And of course, uh, right now, Tales and Tales, our summer reading program kicked off on Monday. Uh, everybody who reads a book and makes a craft gets a pair of Bluetooth earbuds, first come, first serve, of course. Uh, and you'll be also entered to win a grand prize basket that you'll really, really want. It's going to be cool. Uh, so get involved, do some summer reading, come check out some books, and uh, come say hi to me. Anyway, we hope to see you soon. We're open. Until then, stay safe, be well, and uh, thanks so much for tuning in. All right, bye.